Reading of item number, SCP-005 The Skeleton Key, Key to Just About Anywhere. Object Class, Safe. Special Containment Procedures, SCP-005 poses no immediate risk in any direct sense. Even so, its unique functions require special measures be taken to restrict access and manipulation of the object. Approval of at least one, one, level four personnel is required for the removal of the object from its containment area. Description, in appearance, SCP-005 resembles an ornate key, displaying the characteristics of a typical mass-produced key used in the 1920s. The key was discovered when a civilian used it to infiltrate a high-security facility. SCP-005 seems to have the unique ability to open any and all forms of lock, see Appendix A, be they mechanical or digital, with relative ease. The origin of this ability has yet to be determined. Additional notes, SCP-005 may be used as a replacement for lost security passes, but only under the supervision of at least one, one, level 4 personnel. SCP-005 may not be used for vending machine repairs, opening lockers, or for any personnel's spare home key. Removal of the object from the compound will result in immediate termination. Appendix A, while SCP-005 has been shown to be effective in removing almost any form of locking device, further experiments have shown that efforts to disguise the purpose or identity of a lock have proven at least somewhat successful in defeating SCP-005's ability. In approximately 50% of cases where a volunteer was not able to identify a locking device as such, SCP-005 was not successful in deactivating the device. Due to these results, SCP-005 has been tentatively classified as sentient and further tests are being run to determine its cognitive abilities. However, there are no results that show any traits that prevent it from being able to identify any particular locking device, only that the aforementioned device has been heavily concealed and disguised. Breakdown, it's a key you can use to unlock any lock, but the key must be able to tell it's a lock to be able to unlock it. So it's a sentient key of sorts it would be fun to try it on the previous SCP-004 door to see if it opens the safe or dangerous doors. I find it funny that people keep trying to use it like a get out of jail free card when they forget their keys. Don't give bright or cleft access to this key as I fear for the world when either of these two have that kind of power. Excerpt from conversation between two researchers. Jay Green and D. Brown. Researcher Green. I understand it's safe but they should figure out if this thing thinks, what if we are having a serious scenario slinking up on us and we go to unlock a door we don't have clearance for and this thing, thinks it's funny to not open the door. Researcher Brown, look if it was like that don't you think it would do that to you already you're kind of mean to the object screen, last week I seen you throw the key as hard as you could against a wall when requested to by one of the lead researchers. I think it opens the doors cause it can not cause it wants to. I mean they have been trying to figure out if hiding if it's a lock from the thing, works to trick it somehow. Researcher Green, yep well we are approaching the drop off safe box for the item, would you like to grab a bite after we wrap this up? Researcher Brown, sure, oh no I think I left my key and key card back in the testing location, do you have yours? Researcher Green, I got my key card but you know I don't have a key I am still only a level 1 researcher, Mr. Level 4 over here, you know they would demote you for that, well we should try the key here we can call it a private test if you will. Green, places the object in the key slot and scans his key card, the door sounds as if it's opening and Green goes to move forwards into the door. But the door does not move and Green slams his nose right into the door to the safe room's door. Researcher Brown, Good lord man are you okay, you're bleeding, did the key not work? Researcher Green, I have no unearthly idea, I heard the familiar sound of the door moving and then tried to walk in and the door was just there. Researcher Brown, here let me try it. The door slides open normally. Researcher Brown, well it may unlock just about anything, but it looks like it can lock in a grudge as well. If you like this type of content let me know down in the comments, 
I will be doing them in order and adding more of my personal flair to each of the readings. Let me know which is your favorite and I will be sure to add more to that specific one just for you if it's further down the road.